And we're back for another episode. In this episode, we're going to be doing the level 60 Machinist quest in Final Fantasy XIV. And as always, hello from Mifri. What's up? So we are here in um, Ishgard in Foundation at 810. And we need to talk to uh, Stefavivian. So the quest is called the Machinist Choice. Uh, Stefanian appears delighted to see you. Mifri, how fortuitous that you should choose this moment to visit. Pray forgive my abruptness, but are you acquainted with Ishgard's watch and the commoners who fills its ranks? Truly, uh, you worked with Hilda before? Splendid. Absolutely splendid. Let us then discuss the problem at hand. Uh, following our fair city uh, shift to a more um, egal Litrian form of government. Uh, there has been talk of arming the city uh, watch with machinist weapons and equipment. Uh, the very type of um, initiative for which I have long advocated. And as part of this plan, I have been asked to provide a competent instructor. But as dearly as I wish to fulfill this request of Hilda's, I am afraid suitable candidates for the role are in woefully short supply. Surely you've heard news of Alamigo's liberation, yes? Well, the aftermath of the little conflict has seen the manufactory swamped with commissions for both uh, material and marksman. Martial material, whatever. And I've not a single machinist to spare. I was even forced to rel relinquish Joy, my indispensable right-hand woman, to some far-flung deployment. And so, Mifri, uh, you must see why your presence here this day strikes me as something of a godsend. Uh, who better to accept this position than our most accomplished machinist? I understand, of course, uh, you, have ha you have your own business to attend to, and can hardly spend every waking moment training the watch. Thus do I intend to share your duties with our old friend Rustam uh, Rashtashapada, I can't pronounce it. So aside from this extensive knowledge of firearms, he was once the Commodore of the Knights of the uh, Barracuda. Such experience should prove invaluable to the Watch's leadership. He is the natural choice to serve as your partner in this enterprise. From what I've been told, our former instructor was recently spotted arriving in Idleshire. Pray uh, come along, Wifry, um, and lend me a hand in persuading the foul-mouthed brigand to return to Ishgard. Oh. Now, I should be able to teleport straight there. Yeah, thankfully he's standing pretty much right next to the Aether Current. All right, there we go. So, have you seen this place, Mifri? My prost prospectometer is simply overloaded by such potential. Why, the goblin technology amassed in the main square alone could keep me tinkering for days. Uh, not that we'll be here nearly that long. Uh, Rustin is striking a striking fellow. Someone is bound to have noticed him. Shall we ask around? Okay. So, can I interest you in a guided tour of... Oh, just a question. Aye. I've seen such a man. He was just walking down the street, as a matter of fact. Okay. So, ah, big lab with an eye patch, yes? I marked his passage as I would that of any dangerous beast. Uh, stay your path and you'll find him like as not. Oh. Then let's talk to this person. So, I've seen your man headed into the hard place. He was suave and mysterious-like. Had half a mind to follow him in there. Okay.
Uh, ah, I see that you've kept one step ahead of me, Mifri. At least this time around, our dear instructor was not so damnable, damnably difficult to locate, eh? Um, I thought I heard me some familiar voices. Now, what brings the two of you all the way out here? Not just yearning to glimpse this ugly mug again. That much is certain. Um, astute as always, my friend. We have, in fact, come with an offer of employment. Uh, you want me to teach trigger work again? Bugger that. Why don't you all um, have Joy do it? Uh, Joy is far too humble to uh, fare well as an instructor and is fully occupied by other manufacturing business besides. You also have um, considerable experience with commanding a military company, if I am not mistaken. Are you bloody daft or did you just forget? Me piss poor leadership um, of the Kudas is what ruined me reputation in the first place. You all um, honestly reckon a man like me is fit to take charge of training your city watch? Uh, you're the best man for the job. Body else, you must be desperate if I'm the best you've got. Well, scratch hard enough and it might be um, as there's some steel left under this rust. And this means you accept. Uh, trim your sails there, boss. Um, I'll make me final decision after I've had a, ch a chat with this lass uh, what leads the watch. It seems that we must arrange a meeting with Hilda. Would you mind handling the introductions? My thanks. Now, I really should be getting back to the workshop. I have a small mountain of munitions to make if I am to honour all these commissions. Do the manufacturing proud, my friends. Ugh. And just when I was getting bleeding warm again. I'll see you in Ishgard, Mifri. Okay. So, let's go to Hilda in the broom. So, let's teleport. Then we should be able to take the Aethernet straight to the broom. Alrighty. The Aethernet, the broom. Cool. Where is Hilda? Oh, there she is. Um, are we clear, or must I repeat myself in simple terms? <laughs> I expect very little from you low-born riffraff. If you wish to serve Ishgard, then know your place, and keep well out of our way. So, he'd not wipe his tongue like that if his boss was around. And a fine day to you, Mifri. A little bird told me that you'd be on your way. The lads and lasses were well pleased to hear they'd be learning at the foot of Ishgard's saviour. And you must be... Um, I'll warn you right now. The watch is a raw lot. They ain't used to formal training and you'll need to work them hard before they'll count for more than cannon fodder. Like a mod, you say? I do things uh, pirate way, lass. I'll have them p uh, pissing blood and wailing for their mums by first belt. We'll see about that. I don't know about Limsa's back alleys, but the broom's not a place what suffers witting daisies. What my lot lack in skill, they make up for in spirit. 
I like a challenge. Now tell me uh, more about this uh, watch of yours uh, fits into Ishgard's defenses. Well, we're officially back in the arms of the Eorzean Alliance, ain't we? And if the Temple Knights are marched out of uh, to deal with some crisis, the streets will be left a touch thin on soldiers. That's where the watch comes in. We've been something of an independent operation till now, but the houses want to put us on the payroll. They mean to use our numbers to plug their holes in the walls, as it were. And the best part is that we get paid to do more of what uh, we was doing for naught. Uh, coin in our purses and food in our bellies. Can't complain about that. Aye, but the arrangement's not f to everyone's liking. There's inquisitors and nobles alike looking to trip us up at every turn. They ain't keen on the idea of commoners being armed and organized. Hmm. I reckon that the only way to shut down those dudes are down is by convincing everyone else that the watch is something worth keeping. But if we mean to prove ourselves, we need proper equipment and training. That's why I took most of the coin uh, we'd been given and went begging to Lord um, Hulanart. Now that we have firearms and two clever blighters to teach us how to use them. Aye, I've heard enough. Uh, you can't properly protect folk what don't recognize your authority. Just do as old brother says and we'll soon teach them dudes to respect you. Um, here what we uh, were going to do first. Uh, gather a crew of your finest lads and lasses and slap a name on them. One what will get the naysayers to uh, sit up and take notice. What do you mean by uh, an elite company like the Dragoons or the Heavensward? I reckon a good name might impress some of the highborn, but I'll be buggered if I can think of one. Well, let's see. Oh, how about um, Ilda's Hounds? Oh, you mean Hilda's Hounds? Well, I do like the sound of that. Uh, what do you say, lads? <laughs> Woof. As soon as uh, um, they've un sorry, and picked a crew for the Hounds, I'll start teaching. Um, the um the basics and then after they've had a chance to learn barrel from stock you can come back and test their skills unlike a fair division or labor right then i'll whip them into shape before you know it let's see just how tough these broomborn dudes really are okay let's complete So the next mission is quest will be available from Hilda upon reaching level 63. The requirements for undertaking such subsequent quests can be reviewed in your journal. All right. So um, anyway, guys, that's it for this episode. If you liked it, be sure to give it a thumbs up and also subscribe. And as always, goodbye from me and goodbye from Mifri. Bye, guys.